Hi guys, Hermano here and welcome again to the channel. So yesterday I went through the process of installing Arch Linux on a laptop and today I want to go through some basics of the package management, which in Arch Linux is called Pacman, Package Manager. But before I do that, I want to change some settings here as this is a fresh installation. So the first thing I'm going to do is to pull up the GNOME Tweaks application, which was installed during the main install. So let me pull up Tweaks. And I'm going to change the appearance to Advaita Dark. So it's a little bit easier on my eyes and probably on yours as well. And I'll close this. And now I'm going to pull up the terminal. And there you go. I'll make it full screen and make it a little larger so that you can see it better. There you go. So as I said before, Pacman is the Arch Linux package manager and it's very powerful and quite reliable. In this video, I'm going to go through some of the most common commands to install, upgrade, search and remove packages. The first command is related to database update. And there are two ways we can do that. First of all, in order to run Pacman, you have to be super user. So we have to use the sudo command, except for packages query. Well, the first one would be to type in sudo pacman dash capital S Y and hit enter. I'll be asked for my password and hit enter again. And it synchronized the package database. That means if there are new packages in the database since the last synchronizations with the repository, they will be updated. However, there is another way we can actually force the update by adding another Y to the command. So I'm going to pull up again the previous command by hitting on the up arrow and entering another Y and hit enter. And as you can see, the database now it's resynchronizing again through the repository on the internet. So this way you can be sure actually the database is really up to date. Now let me clean up the terminal. Now if we want to update packages, we have two options here as well. So the first one will be to pull up the first command we typed in, which was sudo pacman dash capital S Y and add a U for update at the end and hit enter. And again, says starting full SIMS upgrade, there's nothing to do, my packages are up to date. But we can combine actually this command by forcing actually to check again the database by adding the second Y to the command and hit enter. And as you can see, again, there is no updates, but we forced it through the online repositories directly. I'm going to clean up the terminal. On the next command I'm going to look at is to install packages. Well, that's fairly simple. So I'm going to type in again sudo pacman dash capital S and the name of the package. So in this case, I want to install Firefox as it's not installed by default on Arch Linux. So I'm just going to type in here Firefox and hit enter and proceed with installation. Yes. And there you go. So if I now search for Firefox, as you can see, we have it here. And I'll launch it shortly. And there we have Firefox. So let me close this up. And I'm going to clean up the terminal again. Now, if I actually wanted to just download Firefox, I could have done that by using this command. So I'll add one W and the package name. So in this case, that would be Firefox. In this case, it's going to download the package to the system instead of installing it. So I clean up the terminal again. The next thing I want to show you is how you can search for packages. Well, in this case, we're going to type in pacman dash capital S, small s. I'm going to look for the word gnome and hit enter. So as you can see here, we have a lot of packages relating to GNOME. I want to narrow this search down. So I'm going to clean up the terminal again and pull up the same command. But this time I'm going to add a grep command to it. And I want to look for icons. So I'm going to just type in icon and hit enter. And as you can see, we narrow down the search to the icon term. So this is a very helpful command if you're looking for packages in your system. So let me clean up the terminal. The next command we can look at is how to look for packages information. And we're going to do this by typing in pacman q and then the name of the package you're looking for. So let's say Firefox in this case. Hit enter. 
you can see we have the name of the package and the version number. Clean up the terminal, let's try another one. Let's try GCC in this case. See, GCC is version 9.2.0-4. And we can combine these two actually. So let's look for GCC and Firefox. As you can see, we have both packages there with the version. Now, the last command I want to show you is how to remove packages. So I'm going to clean up the terminal and I'm going to type in sudo in this case, pacman capital R, and then the name of the package. So I want to remove Firefox in this case, so I'm just going to type in Firefox and hit enter. I have to confirm with my password. And yes, I want to remove the package. So I'll type Y and hit enter. And Firefox is gone. So if I'm going to look for Firefox, it's not anymore there. So these are the basic commands for Pac-Man. There are a lot more commands about Pac-Man. I strongly recommend you to look at the Arch website, which I will link in the description below if you're looking to more information about Pac-Man. But these are the basic commands you will probably use every day to manage your system. In the next video, I'm going to look at the AUR, the Arch Linux user repository, and I'm going to show you how you can install packages from there. But for this video, that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you want to see more, make sure you liked it by clicking the like button below, and subscribe to the channel if you want to be notified of future videos. And again, if there's anything specific you want me to cover in Linux, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.